All right. What's going on, my fellow Kino Lords? It is Criterion season yet again. Of course, I have the Blair with me, as I I'm always here. do. <laughs> um, it'll probably be only for this video, though, so yeah. enjoy enjoy, enjoy the Blair while you have it. <laughs> it's my only haul for the season, so happy to be here. Yeah, I might only have, like, another one after this, maybe two total. If, if I actually have some spare money, I maybe have three, but we'll see. Um, and I'm actually going into this pretty blind because I've been so occupied with other things that I haven't really gave any real thought to what's, like, about any, like, new releases and also... Uh, films that I like don't have I honestly haven't given it any thought so I'm I'm going into this pretty blind I didn't even look up what this Barnes and Noble has so hopefully they have some stuff that that I want to buy um mm -hmm. but yeah with that being said let's just let's just go Yay. right into it <laughs> Alrighty. I, would, I have a few in mind yes. I really hope they're here or else I don't know <laughs> well, I already got my eye on the f Jen's favorite film what? Triangle of Sadness 4k uh -huh. <laughs> No. Did you not like it? No, she doesn't like it very much. I like, I liked it. I just, oh, I, I have loved. opinions. I love oh, it. <laughs> You're not allowed to have an opinion. Yeah. Um, Apparently. This is a film that I really, really, really mm -hmm. like. Um, loved it in theaters when I watched it. It was a hoot. Uh, watched it again with Jen. I still loved it, even though she wasn't as huge on it as I was. Oh, um, but I just think it's an excellent <laughs> satirical piece of filmmaking about of course the the wealthy um but yeah, yeah. uh i'm i might i might i'm actually go home with this so i'm gonna hold on to mm -hmm. this for now i'm actually gonna yeah, shit talk yeah. a movie oh, <laughs> starring yes, starring yes, yes. Uh, fresh. starring my favorite actress julia banosh this movie sucks oh. i don't recommend this movie what is that let the sunshine let the sunshine oh, oh that's uh but that's a claire denis film right? i know but it's She's boring so as shit. shit um is i'm only mentioning this movie because my mm -hmm. friend souffle um recently bought it mm -hmm. so Fuck you, Sufi. <laughs> I'm joking. I love, I, love, I love. No, no, that's what you get, Sufi. <laughs> I love it though. <laughs> I would only do do that for him. Oh snap, Wally! Shout I out. forgot this was a thing. I bought that actually. Oh, you got this? Yeah. I'm gonna get Wally. This is ah. probably my third or fourth favorite Pixar film. This is an excellent film. Yeah. Also, one of the most perfect films to come out on Criterion. This and Ratatouille. I'm like really hoping. Yeah. Uh, Ratatouille. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so I, I'm going to put this in the pile. It's not 100% and I'll get it, but I do yeah. love this film. I think it's a beautiful, emotional ride, and um, I just really, really love it. And it's 4K. I mean, mm -hmm. got to gotta have it. Got to do it. It's so cute. Look, it's so cute. The little Pukaracha. Oh, this is the one you were talking about earlier. Yeah, the I, trial. See, I see a lot of people buying that this season. It's from Orson Welles, but I've, I've never heard of it uh, prior to this. So. Me neither. Yeah. But I like the cover. It looks yeah. cool. Yeah, it looks interesting. Mm -hmm. I kind of want to get this. Um, we we talked oh, about yeah. this on the Discord, and uh, I Campion. actually really like it. Yeah, I like this more than mm -hmm. Power of the Dog, by the way. Ooh, um, really? Ah. Yeah, because I don't love Power of the Dog as much as everybody else. Oh, I think it's I think it's really good. But. I loved the Power of the Dog the more I watched it. First time I I really liked it, and the more I watched it, I just really really grew to love the film. Um, yeah. But I haven't seen any of other Jane Campion's work, so I'm really interested to watch the piano. You didn't watch it? No. You weren't there for the discussion. That that, that must have been a Wednesday pick. <laughs> Where it were was, you, Carlos? Yeah, I haven't I haven't been there for like Wednesday picks at least in the past like three four months. Fuck. Yeah, <laughs> I missed that one, bro. I don't know if you'll if you'll love this. Maybe it's divisive. It was a pretty divisive uh, mm. conversation. Okay. I saw this one. Um, um, this is a film that I, I I I've loved for such a long time. Um, but the only reason why I'm bringing this up is because I saw another film from him recently uh, from the filmmaker Hiro, Hiroshi Teshi, Teshigahara yeah. he made a film called uh, the, the Face of Another um, and that is a really really great film uh, I believe I gave that like a solid or strong 8 out of 10 it's a really really good movie for it's time I think it's like kind of mind blowing like what they were able to accomplish I mean not only like thematically but like in terms of special effects it's like really convincing mm -hmm. um, so yeah just a huge shout out to that as well Cool. So, um, one of the very first um, Criterion videos I did with Carlos, I, I blind bought this actually. It's called Symbio Psycho Taxi Plaza. Oh yeah. And I um, remember. I really I really like this documentary. I saw it during the pandemic, and um, mm -hmm. um, it's just a weird documentary about like a filmmaker who's like making this movie that nobody idea what the knows what the fuck's happening oh, yeah, like everybody's just like what the what the hell are we doing we're just like kind of filming some shit nobody knows what's going on it's like but a world's it, experiment kind of yeah it's very experimental and i highly recommend it you know if you if you like the process of you know 
the hey, filmmaking and stuff like that. It's really funny too. That's what surprised me. Oh, that's me. even better. I've I've never heard a movie drop so many f bombs, and I don't mean fuck. I mean the other one. So oh, the, the the amount of f bombs they drop is fucking crazy. I was like, wow. Damn. Like if you did a drinking game, you would be dead. You already own the player. Yeah, I, I love the player. Is I. I remember. Yeah, Carl's not like it. How about Rashomon? Have you seen Rashomon, dude? No. Oh my god, you gotta watch Rashomon. That's an incredible film. That's it's yeah. It's probably my. Probably my favorite Kira Kurosawa. Oh, what? That's well, crazy. It's my. It's kind of tied with. Uh, uh, what's it called? The uh, Man. So, oh, uh, Kira. <laughs> yeah, it, it, yeah, Ikiru. That's that's. Yeah, I'll probably put that above Rashomon, but Rashomon is still like fucking great. I feel bad because I saw Ikiru when I was like super sleepy, so I didn't. Uh, I didn't. I didn't get that much out of it. <laughs> oh, least you're. Yeah, I'm, I'm honest. Yeah. <laughs> it's just circumstances. Are there some time bandits? No, that's Terry Gilliam, right? I think it is uh, Terry Gilliam. Yeah, that that's the only reason I would watch it. They, Criterion must really cool. love him because they keep giving him four things. Yeah, and I just hear a lot of great things about this one. Cause uh, I love Terry Gilliam. The what the fuck is that one called that we watched? The one we saw in theaters. Um, oh, um, the man who killed Don Don Quixote. No, uh, the Fisher King. That one, got oh. a, that one got a four. <laughs> no, uh, not, no not, that, not that dumbass movie. <laughs> no. I mean, no, that no. one's okay. The yeah. Fisher King is really good, though. I enjoyed that one. Yeah. Oh, shout out to Bill uh. Griff and everybody else who, yeah. uh, who won't but shut the fuck up about we, War and Peace. We got a lot of we got a War and Peace stands. In yeah. China. Really? Huge War and Peace stands. Oh, Walkabout. I wouldn't know. Nicholas Roeg. I haven't seen any other Nicholas Roeg film mm -hmm. besides Don't Look Now. Uh, and I really love Don't Look Now. And I heard this is a really excellent film like a really like a uh, existential finding yourself kind of film well, just, the cover looks very yeah, nice it's like a native native type of film oh. um, aborigines i believe in australia i could be wrong but um, i like it i put this in maybe pile because i'm really interested yeah. in it so just this might be a blind buy for me oh look at that i'll shout out souffle <laughs> again in a positive light he uh Yay. he uh i think he said he got this this season um i don't know even know how to pronounce it. it's called dry long so that, that's what it looks like. Um, but I, it, it's a documentary that just recently got added to the collection. And it looks oh. really interesting. I can't even tell you what it's about, but he recommended it to me. And um, I'm interested. Okay. I kind of want to blind buy it. The, yeah, the cover looks interesting. So yeah. see that. Yeah. Have you seen The Servant? Yeah, I like The Servant. Mm -hmm. You like it? We, yeah. I was there for the discussion. Yeah, I like it a lot. Look oh, last time. Nice I just selection. realized. Definitely better than Mr. Klein. Oh, Mr. Klein sucks ass. It's the same director. Uh, Lost Highway, Lynch go. film. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. Um, I don't have Lost Highway or Inland Empire. You need Inland. Empire. So <clears throat> I'll probably just put Lost Highway back for now and get mm -hmm. Inland Empire. I'm not gonna Someone's even kid myself out. here with this. Well, you know, what? I don't know. I'll keep it here for now because I don't know what else I'm gonna find. So I'll keep I'll keep uh, Lost Highway as a maybe. Inland Empire at this point is is probably a must buy. Okay. I recently saw this movie yeah. during Spooktober, Carnival of Souls. Mm -hmm. Shout out to Eugene, because this is... I just know I know he yeah. loves this movie. It's like, it's from the 1960s, but it's really creepy. Oh. Surprisingly creepy, and I don't get creeped out very easily. I believe one, it. Uh, I don't know if I feel like I've watched how that How old one. is that movie? No, we're not. 1962. Oh, okay. For some reason, I get that one and uh, Phantom Carriage mixed up all the time. Yeah, the Phantom Carriage is from the 20s. Yeah. yeah that's, a, that's an old one. And Phantom Carriage, you can literally watch for free on YouTube because it's so old, I think. Yeah, it's like probably in the public domain. Yeah. All the lure. <laughs> Interesting movie. Oh, you've seen it? No, I... Um, so, recently, there was like this... Uh, like this, like, quite... Oh, there you go. <laughs> I want to see it! There was this... Uh, Criterion oh. like quiz thing that you could take it was like which Criterion oh, are you I did that. and I, I took the Criterion quiz and for some reason it was like you are the lure and it gave me this <laughs> film and it's weird because it's like a musical and I normally fucking hate musicals yeah uh, but but that's yeah, what you were I might just blind bite just because of that just because of that yeah uh. I got um this uh what the fuck is his name damn it who uh Tree of Life guy oh Terrence Malick mm -hmm. yeah I got a Terrence Malick film called like the Lost Kingdom, some shit like that. Mm. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'm getting that fucked up. I never heard of that. Somebody's gonna. <laughs> yeah, really, someone really in the comments like, hmm. It's no good. Ooh, this is another one I want to blind buy, but I don't know if I will. 
Oh yeah, this is a burial. This is a burial, not a burial. It's a resurrection. Ah, yeah. I don't even know what this movie's about. I'm just so interested in it. It's a documentary, I think. Yeah, it's it's a documentary. Mm. Oh, wasn't this a this one actually? uh, Quite on. Monday Blind Rex recently. Oh. It's a. uh, I think this is a Mizuguchi. No, this is a Kobayashi film. Um, Who I believe is behind, like the Human Condition, right? I think so. (laughs) <laughs> and also um, Harakiri could be wrong. I get I get it mixed up. Sometimes. I haven't seen either of those movies. Oh my god! What? <laughs> yeah, I have never seen Harakiri. <laughs> or or the Human Condition. Those are two ten out of tens, dude. Yeah. yeah. Um, but I heard this is like a three hour like surreal horror samurai epic type of film, mm. um, and I'm really interested in it. But I haven't seen it. I have too many blind buys right now. I think. But it's so samurai. I'll, I think it is. That I could sounds, be wrong. That sounds nice. I could be fucking wrong. I might be wrong. Maybe I'm just racist and I'd see a Japanese movie as a samurai. <laughs> oh, no. I can't <laughs> confirm what <it> is. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I'm not part of that. I, I haven't seen this mm-hmm. movie, but I love this packaging. I yeah, think it's beautiful. Really so cool. I, it almost makes me want it, but I don't know. Maybe. Oh, is that the uh, like David the, Bowie documentary thing? Yeah, Moonage Daydream. Oh, do you okay. have this, dude? I know you love this film. I love La Cienaga. Oh, you already own it? Yeah. Okay. The what? I thought it was a good movie. Like, it's... Uh, <laughs> Don't I, do it, <laughs> I didn't... I didn't... I just didn't... <laughs> oh, I, great, no. I just didn't... I don't know. I didn't yes, click... Yes, what did you do, Carlos? I, I didn't click with this nearly as much as everybody else did mm. in the Discord. I mean, they all pretty much hail this as a damn near masterpiece. I think it's... Yeah. Decent, but like My, not that great. Mike uh, gives it a ten. Eugene gives it a ten. Oh. I I give it a nine, but that's I mean that's a great. It's a great. It's a great uh. yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, what what are these days? I'll, I'll go. I'll I'll try to give another shot. But <laughs> I'll speak to Terry Gilliam. Jabberwocky. Huh? I've always been interested in this film. I know it's not like it doesn't have the best reception, but they they just love Terry Gilliam. I just yeah, and I love Terry Gilliam, so I just feel like giving it a shot one of these days, but probably won't do it this time <laughs> not this time oh, i got too much shit in my hand i don't know if i've shouted this movie out um in, in, the, in the channel but this movie is one of my uh i think it's one of my favorites of all time now i just think that the oh. performance from uh, uh. <laughs> i don't remember her <laughs> name but she's amazing in the movie have you seen it Leave her to heaven? No, I have not. Oh, you gotta watch it. <laughs> I've not seen it. <laughs> I don't think I've seen you, uh, or I don't think it, I've seen the shout out for that. Really? No, yeah, I I adore this movie. Um, oh. One of my favorite pre nineteen seventies movies. Easily. Cool. It's it's Technicolor and it's amazing use of Technicolor. Last Temptation of Christ. Very oh, underrated cool. Scorsese. You have not seen this movie I've not yet. Seen that one. Oh, Dude, man. you gotta watch Last Temptation. It's. I mean, I, you already know I love Scorsese. I love that old man so much. We all love Scorsese. And I, I feel like that's one of his most like overlooked films. Yeah, it's, really, really it's great. It's very good, and it has, you know. It has Jen's husband right there. He's so oh, awesome. Yeah, I hope everybody knows Jen finds Willem Dafoe genuinely I attractive. Do. She thinks that's like the most attractive man he's ever seen. I love that. And not even like being funny. I'm not. He, he is. Though. Look at him. He's so chiseled. I'm gonna shout out Daisies real quick. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Oh, holy shit. Dave, this is actually this week's uh, mm-hmm. Blind Wreck for Saturday. Uh, day for Night. Oh. Friends Watch Your Foe film. Mm-hmm. Hmm, maybe I'll blind buy it. To confess my my uh, dedication and loyalty to, to the crazy. server. By the way, if you want to join Discord, $5 a month. <laughs> Patreon. Let's <laughs> throw that in really fast, real quick. <laughs> I really was hoping they'd have EO. I'm gonna check. We'll check the, the new release. Can I check yeah. the handcap to yeah. see if they have it? All right. Off I go. Yeah, yeah you can follow it. Yeah. Let's yeah. go. Okay. <laughs> Yay. Okay. I'm gonna stalk here um, for a little bit. They do have some new releases mm-hmm. here, but so far I'm just seeing Nanny. I I'm surprised uh, this got a Criterion release. I I haven't seen this, but. It's a. It's been like lukewarm, I think. Oh, from I haven't even seen it. Nanny. I've never heard of that. Really? It's like a. I think it's a. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. It's a horror <laughs> movie, but it, it's not like amazingly reviewed. Ah. Oh, I do want this. But I'm probably going to get the 4K. Oh, yeah. Mildred Pierce. That movie was a damn oh, yeah, masterpiece. Another great Technicolor um, 
1940s movie, but yeah. Yeah, I'd see that one really praised. I don't remember if I, I watched it. I see a lot of new releases here that I want to get. No? <laughs> and where's Last Picture Show? I need them. And I have it, man. Damn. I might ask them. Because yeah. I, I really want that one. Hi. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, they might have it. But like, not on display. Yeah, maybe. I have asked them to get something from the back of the Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, what do you want? Oh, uh. yeah, Eo. I think I might find I just found Eo for you. Is this, is this the Blu-ray? That's yeah. not what I should oh, record. Oh, we're a cartoon. Yeah, this is it. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, let's have a 4K release for it. No, no, no. Okay, yeah. you just found Eo. <laughs> Yay! Yeah, I appreciate your help. Thank, Thank you. Movie. Oh, Thank yeah. <laughs> I remember y'all talking about that a lot. I'm so sorry to bother you. Thank you. There is one I really mm -hmm. Last picture show. Last picture show. Okay. Thank you so much. I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> so sweet, Eric. I'm gonna bug the poor worker. Oh, we suck. And don't look now is um. I was really happy when I mm -hmm. bought this film because I bought it right before it went out of print, and then they brought it back to print. <laughs> so now it's not as valuable as I thought oh. it was. Oh. <laughs> but it's still I a really that good movie. One, yeah. I was like, oh, I got a super rare movie that if I ever want to sell for a bajillion dollars, I can. <laughs> I have it now. Now it's yeah. just as invaluable <laughs> as anything else. You bought it before they almost did that, so you know. I'll still give myself some, some credit there, though. Yeah. Ooh, I'll shout out this when I can. Mm -hmm. Two Lane Black Top. Oh, yeah, I like that one. Really great uh, car culture type film, but it's actually not really that much about car culture at all. It's actually about the people and yeah. the relationships that are within car type culture mm -hmm. and it's to me it's a really it was a surprisingly different film than i thought going into it um i thought it was really compelling so i have a review on if you want to hear more in-depth thoughts but this is a really really good movie uh, yes. shout I, out to uh, blake bergman mm -hmm. who uh recommended this film to me to begin with it's really good yeah i also very much enjoyed it mm -hmm. it's not what you think not at all i think that's about it i don't think i know oh, it well, I just love when I just score by and I see Antichrist. Yeah, it's just, it's just, it was, <laughs> it makes me happy. I was hoping you would actually mention yeah. it. I was like, look at Antichrist that. Antichrist is so good. Your eyeballs immediately like, oh, I know what that is. 10 out of 10 masterpiece. <laughs> I think it's yep, it. Yep. I don't really see any more. This nice selection. Yeah, um, shout out to... Uh, yeah? Shout out to Jada in the Discord. She recommended A Touch of Zen like three times. Oh. Uh, hasn't won yet. Um, I think it might just because it's a really long film. I think it's like... like but how long? Three hours tops? Yeah, I think That's it's like three bad. hours. <laughs> three hours? Oh, psh. Or, close, or at least close to three hours. That's newbie. Come back when it's six hours. I think that's it for me. I don't really mm -hmm. see any more. Did they, did they have it for you? Yeah. Yes, the um, he was he was super nice, and uh, this is the one that I yeah. like. I needed to have for this season. I, everything else, I don't care, but this is the one. Oh. I I love this movie. Shout out to Mitchy in the Discord. Yeah. Um, he lo he loved this movie, and I was curious enough to check it out, and I'm so happy that I got a uh, 4K release. Yeah. I like cool. it a lot too. I'll give oh, it eight out of ten. It. It's really good. Yeah. Um, cool. did, did he have any more of those over there? Is that the only one? Uh, I'm not sure. I don't, <laughs> I don't I'm scared. <laughs> I'll just get it next time. Yeah. <laughs> really? Um, there's some. I think it's about it for me personally. Okay. I have to whittle this down. There's no way I'm gonna get. Yeah, all you'll this. have like a mighty. Are you still stack. searching, or are you done? I think I'll take Look another look. Okay. Sorry. I'll probably I'll just go ahead. Yeah. You whittle mine down. Okay. So we'll just do it right here. Okay. Want. All right. Whatever that means. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna wean it down. <laughs> uh, day day for night. That's a maybe. Right. That's yep. the maybe blind wreck. I actually have to watch before uh, before Saturday. Um, oh, that's pretty. Quite on. Really love this filmmaker. I'll put it on the maybe file because mm -hmm. I haven't seen it. We were another blind buy. Okay. That's the only only reason why I'm even considering this is because apparently the Criterion website that this film is me core but ah, mm. I suspect foul play <laughs> <laughs> Triangle of Sadness I gotta get Triangle of Sadness 4k fantastic um, film okay <laughs>
Um, Inland Empire, I'm gonna get for sure. Mm -hmm. Walk about to blind by Wally. I oh, love Wally. It's Wally. I think I'm gonna get Wally. I just love that film so much. <laughs> gonna be like what? Now I'll choose between the blind by wait, wait, three. I think three might be my limit though. Well, you, I mean, how much is this? Fifty bucks. So it's twenty-five, fifty, seventy-five. Yeah. I can help. I know, because you're a sweetheart. I appreciate no. that. But I still am Say those things. Still trying to be fair to the budget. Okay. Um, well, Wally is Wally always here? Yeah, but I want this movie. Oh, it is very cute. And these are always here, too. These are new. This is also new releases in a way. This is not super new, but this is like really uh, new, I think. Um, I would go with this one. I don't know why. But I, yes. Walk about. Oh, I know why. I'm biased, but yes. It's <laughs> <laughs> There's sure. a moon in it. Why not? I'll, I'll go with this one. Have some sense of adventure. That yeah, that's, yeah. Some, <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. All right, adventure. I'll put these back. Um, <laughs> oh, but what about Day for Night, though? This is oh, this week's I, Blind Wreck. Yeah. Uh, oh. And I could be a way for me to watch it. Just pop it in. Just watch mm -hmm. it. We could watch Maybe it. You should. We could watch it tomorrow or something. Yeah. Maybe you should probably do that one. You know that's what? I think I'm going to yeah. do she had all these, I think. They'll kick see. our butt. These are five, though. I was not going to get five. Maybe we should put a walkabout back for now. Which one? This. Oh, yes. That one, yes. Because you, I think you should get this one if this is your... This is a blind rig. Yeah. And, and, and this will be back. first. This will be back for sure next time yeah. I go to Barnes & Noble because it's like a new release. So. Okay. All right. I'll put this... I'll get day for night. I'll swapping walkabout out for day for night right now. All right. And then I'll watch it. Yeah. Yeah. And if you want to hear my extensive thoughts about Day for Night, uh, join the Discord. We're going to discuss it on Saturday. Yeah. $5 a month on Patreon. <laughs> Let's right, do it. <laughs> Which ones are you getting? Sorry. Oh. I, I, you can just show me the spines. You don't have to like tell me. <laughs> awesome. I'm, I'm also getting four. You're getting four? Okay, cool. Cool. Awesome, awesome. Yay. Yeah, I'm sorry. I was like in my own world. No, no you're, <laughs> you're fine. Good. Are you ready to put your Yeah, yep. this, this is the ones I'm going to get. Oh, okay. All right. So Let's obviously the last picture show. Mm -hmm. Just mentioned that one. Yep. Um, I'm gonna go with the piano because yes, 4K it looks beautiful. Mm -hmm. EO. It does. Um, I saw this movie very early this year, and um, I love donkey movies. Oh, <laughs> so cute! It's very, it's it's very <laughs> That's adorable. tragic. Let's just put it that way. Aww. And this is gonna be my blind buy of today. Yay. It's it's not a burial; Finally. it's a resurrection. So. Hopefully it's good. Yeah, and I'm I'm interested in that one too. That so. is my modest haul mm -hmm. of the season. Yeah, <laughs> I think it's a really big one though, because four is like, oh, that's a chunk. Yeah, it is. I mean, it's not, it's not, it's, it's not, not Perry core. Or anything, yeah, it's not. Yeah. <laughs> I can't, I can't stack up to the heights that Perry, Perry has. Yeah, that's scary. <laughs> well, I think that's it, everybody. Appreciate mm -hmm. y'all watching. Yeah, um, awesome. <laughs> yeah, you know the deal. Like, subscribe to the channel if you enjoyed yeah. what uh, what you saw here. Um, again, I'll probably do one more haul, um, one more Ed store haul, maybe a third one if I find myself to have a little bit of extra money, but um, pretty much only one more after this. And um, that's about it. Really appreciate yeah. it. See y'all later. Thank you. Yay, thank you. <laughs>